welcome to my channel i am delhi and today we are posting a japan vlog so i went back in april and we actually went to visit ali who is one of our sisters in the navy and she is stationed out there so um they're twins and they're celebrating their 21st birthday this year Woo! so we definitely went to go celebrate there in japan but we are gonna cover a lot in this video so i will definitely try to put chapters with the timestamps and everything and it's just gonna be a lot so i really hope you enjoy the trip with me and of course feel free to skip over areas that you're not interested in that's totally fine if you're new here i am delhi and i am an artist i am 23 years old and i do a lot of art posts makeup stuff i also do vlogs so if you are interested and if you like the vibes and if you just like good vibes go ahead and hit that subscribe button and like this video at the end if you enjoyed the vlog anyways without further ado we do have a lot to cover so we'll just jump right into the video and let's head to japan <laughs> So good thing we came Filipino time and came like 500 hours early because Hawaiian was having issues with my mom's ticket. This is just the first sign that things were kind of rocky. Basically, they had the wrong name on the ticket even though on her ticket online it is the correct name. So they're very strict about that when you're flying international. So you definitely want to make sure that your names match. But that was on their end. So they also mentioned that they just started a new system so that their system was kind of like fighting with the old system and whatnot so yeah So this is the start of when our nightmare happens. Once we got service, my mom got an email showing that our flight to Japan was canceled. And this was an hour before we were about to land in Hawaii. So we were already on the plane when they canceled our flight. 
We were directed to go to the service counter and there were a lot of other people here so I'm sure there was this problem for a few other people. Mind you, the Hawaiian airport is very large so it took a while to just get here. When we finally reached the counter, they directed us to Where go to pick our up luggage? our luggage at Where? baggage claim and <laughs> our baggages weren't there. Hawaiian Airlines has failed us today. It was also very hot and humid and we didn't have any of our stuff. There was a lot of other people that were upset too, so I don't know what happened with Hawaiian uh, Airlines, but there definitely was some issues going on with their new system. Also, we were booked on separate flights, so me, my mom, and Ellie were on one flight on Asiana, and Ali was actually booked for a flight on Japan it's Airlines. Raining. So we were going to be landing separately. <laughs> Baggage claim ended up telling us that our luggage would be automatically transferred, so we went and headed to the Asiana, which was at Lobby 4 and quite a walk. Oh shoot. Well, she has time. Here we are. Still walking. Well, can't board this one. Boarding already close. <laughs> Here's our good friend Harrison, who we actually met at the customer service at the line earlier and we ran into him here so there were a couple other people with the same issues basically Asiana had closed their boarding so we're now frantically looking for a luggage again Philip the manager at Hawaiian Airlines had told us to meet him at lobby 2 guest services to get our rebooking information and that they would book us a hotel at this point it was already like two or three hours of walking back and forth trying to figure out our luggage and we still didn't have it we were super tired, hungry, hot. We've been walking around looking for our luggage and they don't have it. That airline doesn't have it. Aviana doesn't have it. Hawaiian doesn't have it. Baggage claim doesn't have it. They keep telling us to go to either one. So I have no idea what's going on. This is kind of ridiculous at this point now. Like we've been walking around forever and this airport isn't exactly the smallest thing ever either. So yeah. First time trying to go to Japan and the experience so far hasn't been great. This is recording. Okay, so look at what I'm wearing right now. A pants. It's hot, it's humid, we're in Hawaii. I was ready to be dressed for Japan weather. And we're running around back and forth looking for a baggage because no one has it apparently. And all our clothes are in there, so this is the only room clothes I have. So we're running around, trying to find our baggage. And we also made some friends who have also gone to cancel flights too. So he's trying to us right now. Um, all of us are trying to find our stuff. And we're back at the same lobby again. There is no one at Gress Services. We're still looking for her bags, but Ali got a flight to Japan, so she's she's good to go. Mom is a little angry. <laughs> We're all sweaty and tired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They also said that they were booking us a new flight tomorrow, but they didn't give us. I know it's a Mirari. This is. <laughs> so I don't know, there's a lot of people here that also had the canceled flight and we're all just sweaty, tired, hungry. So yeah, we So we're still waiting for the manager of Hawaiian Airlines. He's trying to accommodate us for some hotels to stay at today, but we basically wasted today. And um, yeah, there's like seven of us here that are just like left in the dark right now and we have no idea where our luggages are. No one's really telling us where to go. Everybody just kind of like confused and nobody knows where our stuff is. And we don't even know if we're gonna have a place to stay right now. So, but um, we're just waiting to see what happens. Oh. So, at least they gave us some water, some jungle rain, and 
Oops. Water and juice. Okay, we're finally picking up our baggages. They have finally been dropped. If it's here. If it's here. We will update you that on the next clip right here. Still looking for our baggages. They said that it was already down here at baggage, um, baggage, baggage claim. And I've checked all of these. Still can't find our baggage. So, I don't know. This is kind of ridiculous at this point. I've been trying to be so patient, but I'm like tired, I'm hungry, I'm sweaty. I don't have any other pair of clothes and like, I just wanna relax, I'm tired. We're here at baggage services and we gave them our little ticket. So hopefully that they find our baggage in the bag. If not, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> we got our luggage. <laughs> like four hours later, mom, dude. Mom, mom, mom. <laughs> Finally. Ten years later. Okay, next thing is uh, we have to go elevator. Remember? Was this a, no, the elevator was the next one. But got our luggage, but we have to go fix Ellie's ticket because they put her sister's name instead of her name and they have to book us a flight and then we're gonna do our hotel which I think they already booked the hotel right right mom oh but we also need the itinerary because we need proof you know just in case they're like ah oh, yeah can't do it you know get everything on paper guys get everything on paper Now we're going back. Going back. There's the gang. There's the canceled flight gang. Where's uh? So you have to change yours. Oh my gosh. It's coming out. Yeah. Dinner meal voucher, fifteen dollars for airport food. And there's breakfast for ten dollars. Yay. Oh yeah, you still don't have yours, huh? <laughs> So this, uh, the food, the... How are we supposed to eat breakfast right now? Breakfast voucher expires, expires tomorrow. tomorrow. Yeah, expires tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> it's expires tomorrow. Dinner is okay. also tomorrow. I think this is the thing you just give us $15 and 10. Um, but they gave us hotel voucher and um, transport to the hotel. Um, yeah, and we still need to get a printed itinerary. So we literally just switched over to this new like system like three days ago. So that's what's taking everyone so long because no one yeah, so the previous system vouchers we were able to use at the hotel. Um so that's why I'm going under the assumption that they will accept it. Um because we haven't had it. but just to be safe, uh safe receipts, email CAO, uh, consumer affairs and um Tell them that you're on the council for another flight this, okay. uh, this afternoon. Okay. And, um, yeah. One more question for you. Are you sure? Because it's a one more question, two questions. <laughs> no, no. We want to make sure this is taken care of before yeah, yeah. we go out that door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we gonna get some kind of confirmation either on an email or the app? So for tomorrow's it, flight. It's gonna be your same confirmation code because they basically just rebooked you guys. Sure. Yeah, I'm better be sure because I'm Yeah, going... I know. That's yeah, no, 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 no. Because so, 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 we've so... been trying to figure this yeah. out for five hours already. Yeah, okay. So, so hold on. Okay. I know. Yeah, you can okay, hold on. I'm, yeah. Okay, I'm so that's all. Yeah, yeah. So okay. once I finish here, then I will go double check. But yeah, the person that issued the voucher is rebooked and then you have to rebook to issue. Oh, no. We still need the passport. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so, so they have to rebook you to yeah. issue the vouchers. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Okay. Yeah. So same place over the lobby for. Sorry about the inconvenience. Uh, believe me, if I knew that this was going to happen, I would have called out sick today, but I'm here with you guys. No, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, um, Charlie's goes, stops by in different locations. So go down to the baggage service, the office, and ask them where to, ask them where to take the taxi. Okay. Because okay. sometimes they kind of move around. Okay. So you're gonna go you go straight down this escalator on the left hand side, take it downstairs, go to the baggage service office to ask more the Charlie's is picking up from. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, thank so, you. Thanks. Okay, yes, hi. I know you're waiting, right? Yes, but I okay, uh great. We're still waiting for our passports. Thank you. Are we wanted to carry on all 
miss me. Miss me. What? I miss me. I miss me. Turn around again. Which one do you want? Oh, uh, I'll take this one. Thank you. Are you guys sleeping? No, so you guys have to check in. You have to check in again. So come three or four hours before your flight. Three or four hours before? Yes, before your flight. What time is the flight? What time is the flight? So it's going to be the, um, hopefully the same planet of flight. So many guys, like, like I said, three or four hours. Um, if you guys want, There'll be a taxi at that time. There should be. So yeah, like I said, we have all the ground transportation for to the hotel and then back to the airport. Oh, okay, okay. So you're going to use this one first for the hotel. Go. And this is for the um, back to the airport. This is for all three of you guys mm -hmm. for the hotel. Okay. But yes, you guys are all rebooked. Mm -hmm. uh, let me just double check with the flight real fast, okay? So I can give, give you guys like yeah. an accurate time. Yeah. Okay, cool. thank you. We are finally leaving. Going to get a taxi now to go to the hotel. <laughs> We're keeping um, receipts <laughs> just in case. <laughs> okay, on our way to get a taxi to go to the hotel and enjoy the little time we have in Hawaii. Yay. Bye -bye. Then we have to get back tomorrow four hours before. Four our hours flight. before our flight. Because of their new system. <laughs> Here we are at the taxi. The limo scene. We're gonna take the limo. Huh? Limo. Limo. <laughs> Okay, we finally made it to our hotel. My sister and my mom got their own room and got this one. They all have two beds, um, but I have this whole room to myself. Two beds and a balcony. And it's pretty big in here actually. And then the bathroom's really nice. <laughs> uh, they also have a bidet, which is cool. And the shower, very nice. And a mirror. It was a journey getting here and we're ready to eat but we are officially in Hawaii. My hair is like super crazy from the humidity and the sweating and everything that happened today. <laughs> so, um, but we're so hungry so I think we're just gonna go and grab some food first and then I'm gonna shower after we get back. But this is the result of, I don't even know how many steps we did today. I should go check. Good check. Very, I believe this is a very Hawaiian vibe going on. <laughs> we're hungry, so we're gonna go eat. We are staying at the Marriott, and thankfully the airport did cover the hotels. <laughs> so here we are, vibing. So I guess the trip wasn't so bad. At least we got to stay in Hawaii. <laughs> a day and a night. But, well, yeah, it should have been earlier, but it did take a long time. But we could still walk around at night. But, oh, look at the picture. Aloha. It's so cute. We are trying to find the restaurant right now.
this was $22 for three tiny tacos. <laughs> Look at all that salt. <laughs> I'm trying to make the most of this trip though, so. At least we are in Hawaii. Oh, yeah, uh, no, I didn't use the bidet because I'm scared to use it. I don't know how to use it. <laughs> I will probably try the bidet later. the airport um, and hopefully be on our way to Japan this time um, we're coming four hours early to our flight so um, that was recommended to us by um, the workers there and fingers crossed we make it there because our sister is in Japan right now by herself <laughs> so this is my fit because we're Gonna be on the plane for another like 10 hours, so I wanted to be a little bit comfortable. Um, yeah, so hopefully things work out. Eating leftover. There's that one. Hey. <laughs> and the sun is rising. Airport again. There's LA all the way over there. Walking because we were at the wrong one. They didn't tell us where to go, so walking all the way to lobby two or four. We're not sure. But here we are again. Nobody is giving us proper directions, so. Lobby will be full. And fingers crossed, fingers crossed. We got it, yay! Time to go to Tokyo. <laughs> Time to get to TSA. We're gonna pass TSA. We are still looking for a gate because our ticket does not say gate on it. And we checked the flights departing, but our flight's not on there, so not really sure <laughs> again what's going on. Um, kind of left in the dark again, trying to run around looking for answers. So, but we're just gonna. 
deep searching. Nobody's at the information desk, so there's like literally nobody to ask. So, what is going on, Hawaiian? What is going on? International or every information desk we've been to so far, nobody's there. I'm like, we don't know where our flight is. We're not gonna go to all these gates trying to find it. But there's different TVs here, so hopefully we can find it right here. This voucher was not taken, even though the voucher says breakfast, airlines. It's so stupid, not Hawaiian. They're in. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, so don't know what's going on. Hawaiian Airlines, I'm so sorry, but you guys totally screwed a lot of people over. And I know the staff was trying to help, but it was really like a nightmare. This whole thing is a nightmare. Like, hopefully we get to the plane though. Drinkity, so. drinkity. <laughs> One at the Hawaiian information desk on Seaside. We were supposed to go to Seaside because um, there would be someone, but I think it's too early for everybody. <laughs> mm, so I don't know. But at least we're early, so we have time to look. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, so. Um, we're front row seat. Hopefully. <laughs> Able to see our flight, and we're waiting for someone to show up at that desk so we can go ask them. But someone told us that C, C2 and C9 are usually where the international Hawaiian airline flights are, but to be determined. Uh, it is getting super frizzy and from the humidity of uh, walking around, even though I just straightened it, but oh well. Whatever. I just want to get to Japan. <laughs> so I got some drag guava, drag guava, and tuna jerky. Guava airplane. And Ellie got some puzzles to stimulate her brain on the. <laughs> no. Do you want that? <laughs> There's nobody here but us. But this is apparently what, where it's supposed to be. What? I have seen that. I lived in San Francisco with you, you know. <laughs> I do remember. What does it remind you of? San Francisco. I don't know what. Actually. We welcome our military personnel, veterans, and their families. All right, we have the army. So, update. The app says that we're supposed to be here at C9, but there's like nobody here. So, a one person came, but hopefully, this is the right place. <laughs> Made myself a BLT <laughs> with the Tuna jerky, and I gave Ellie the ham. And yeah. Our plane, it's you. Uh, um, it is currently 12 20 something. They were supposed to start boarding at 12 05. I think they did call like one or two people, but. It is 12.20, boarding stops at 12.35, right? Yeah, and we were supposed to leave at 12.50, so not sure what the delay is, but there's still a room full of passengers here. Thank you for your service. Never mind, they, I guess they haven't started boarding yet. So, don't Okay, I think we're officially starting boarding now. Officially boarding! Yay! <laughs> Yay! We made it! We're boarding! We got a blankie! Hello! We are finally going to Japan. <laughs>
Tesla time is approximately 4.45 p.m. Now we'll be taxing for the next few minutes. Don't open that. Keep it. I don't think you can bring it to the video. We're here in Japan. <laughs> no, we didn't see him. Oh my gosh. What's this one? This is the single bedroom. It's a lot smaller because um, it's only one bed, but this is, this is the room. And they actually have a whole glass right here. Um, there is a curtain that you can pull down for the bathroom. Um, this is, oops, the bathroom. Oops. But this is the bathroom. Cute little sink and the shower and you have a view of the bed from the bathroom <laughs> but you can close those of course so um there's like little holes in it though still <laughs> but yeah i mean i'm the only one in here but we're super super tired so be prepared for the first day to walk around and basically take the train to um, your hotel. Um, it, the hotel that we stayed at from, it was 18 minutes away from the airport, um, but that's for driving. So on the train, it was like about 30, 40 minutes on the train. So be prepared to wait another 30, 40 minutes before you get to your place. And you will have to hop off different trains as well. So just, Make sure you <laughs> look at the schedule online. Thankfully, our sister, um, she's she's been here um, for a while because she's stationed out here. So um, she was able to kind of help us out and we just kind of followed her along. But um, yeah, if we didn't have her, I think we would have a little bit of a hard time figuring things out and missing trains. And also, if you have a lot of luggage, it is going to be a lot of, it's going to be really hard to like, bring everything around um 
but yeah this is this is Tokyo <laughs> um we're kind of tired we haven't eaten yet but this is the view from the window um I believe that's like an office building across the street um but yeah it was a journey to get here so the hotel gives you this um pajama set i think and they also give you slippers or wabaki the tv is pretty small um and then they also give you i believe this is a fan so you just plug it into the wall um but yeah there's not much walking room in the hotel so the door has magnets which is pretty cool you could just stick it on the door check. Oh, there's a doorbell? Yes. Oh, and there's a doorbell. <laughs> yeah, so I guess we're going to 7-Eleven. I'm excited. That's cool. I'm hunky. So the hotel gives you these. Um, if you forgot, toothbrush, razor, and hairbrush. And other thingies. And they're complimentary. So we're gonna go to 7-Eleven. Start getting used to being on the lift, Dad. Got my little puffer jacket on. Oh, there's the mother. <laughs> it's pretty cold here, but like it's like a good cold. I don't feel like too chilly. And I have just like leggings and this jacket and it was a shirt under this just a t-shirt but it feels really the air feels really clean and fresh oh they have a wendy's <laughs> they have wendy's yeah there's like Ooh. There's noodles and bread. <laughs> and there's more stuff in the back. They have like packaged meals or pre-made meals and some some rolls here. And little sneakies. Oh tuna mayo, the onigiri. have all these sandwiches. Oh, the baby sandwiches. I thought that was like the, the sticks. 
from oh, yin yang yin yang oh. the yin yang oh, yeah. yeah but that's a yogurt drink a strawberry yogurt and they have chunks inside oh like mm -hmm. strawberry chunks mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It tastes like gogurt. <laughs> <laughs> with with fresh fruit in it. Okay, it's starting to drop its leaves. Right? You you wanna go? I need sleep. What are we doing, guys? Why don't we go there real quick? Oh, there's a family mart too. What happened? It's a piggy. Don't get run over by the bike. Here. So, do not drink and eat while you walk it is considered rude here. Um, this that's just their culture here, so um, I'm not used to the, that. So I keep like taking a sip of my drink. But <laughs> anywhere you go, you do want to respect their culture and their ways. So try to remind yourself. This is where um, to turn on the light because lights turn off when you're not in here. See, so the lights turn off when you don't have the key in here, but you just put it in there and the lights turn on. And I believe you can adjust the lights and stuff over here. I think. Yeah. So you click it and it'll turn off. I kind of like seeing the bathrooms. It's cool. So, I'm wearing the robe that they left. And I feel like a, you know. <laughs> so we're gonna be heading to Disneyland tomorrow at eight in the morning. So I'm gonna head to bed now. I'm gonna head to bed now. Um, so I'll probably have to wake up like 7 in the morning or earlier to get ready and to at least eat something for breakfast. So, see you guys tomorrow. Okay, I did not realize that this video was going to be this long. So I am actually going to split these into different videos because I feel like if I crammed everything into one video, it would turn into a whole entire movie. So... This video is just gonna be um, about obviously the journey to getting to Japan. Next video, we will be taking our first official day in Japan and we will be going to, I believe, Disneyland. So we're gonna be going to Disneyland Tokyo and we will take you along there. So if you guys want to go see that video, I will definitely link that in the bio for you. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one and follow along with the chapter. So <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already and like the video if you enjoyed. Bye.